Alright guys, and welcome back to more Persona 4 Golden Redux, and last time we started up a few different, uh, social links. I believe we started up the Hero Fin, it was the only one we started up last episode. But anyway, what we need to do currently at this moment is actually go ahead and try to finish that, uh, the Emma request that we got from the box <clears throat> yesterday. So what we need to do is actually find that girl. She should have a cloud bubble over her head. I think it's this guy. Oh wait, that's a guy. Never mind. What the hell? Oh, right there. I walked past her. Like, what the hell is wrong with me? Here, here she is. This is the girl we need to talk to. It's the girl that mistakenly put a love letter inside your shoebox. Did, did you read my letter? Of course I read that. Cause I thought it was. For, I thought it was for me. I didn't even have the courage to sign it, and yet a totally random person now knows my secret. What's the point of trying to be secretive anymore? I've already embarrassed myself this much. I might as well go confess. How do you like that? Oh, I, whoa. Maybe you should ask her about how her confession went. Damn it. So we got to wait another day. And the thing is about Emma requests, you only want to hand in, for the best suitable days to hand in the damn request to the fox, is to hand in the quest, once you complete everything, is on a rainy day. Because that's when you can't hang out with anybody else but the fox on the rainy days. So only turn in quests when it's a rainy day, at least. That's what I've learned from my past playthrough. But anyway, um... I think that's all we can do for now since it is a rainy night. We can go into the TV world to get some good training in. Because you see, you run into a lot more rare monsters inside the TV world since it's a lightning day. Or it's, since it's raining and lightning. You run into more rare. And you also run into more hands. But anyway, what we probably want to do now is actually go to the central shopping district. And probably get a hero fence type persona. Look at this guy. You know about the Midnight Shadow. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, it's one of Mo Welcome Marie's notes. Something is different. Marie is nowhere to be found. If you are looking for Marie, I sent her on an errand. She should be back soon. <laughs> Where did you send her? Oh, please don't be concerned. <laughs> this errand is, of course, pertaining to those of us who reside within the Velvet Room. I would never allow her to roam your world freely by herself. There's a piece of paper on the floor. Oh. What is that? She must have dropped it. Chuckle. You see, she's laughing. Margaret is behind this. She has to be behind dropping the, her poems on the floor. It's so fucked up that she does it. Margaret is so fucked up, man. <laughs> you know there's something written on it. Perhaps she re should return it to her. Huh. Whoa, no, wait, no! <laughs> Marie frantically snatches the paper away from you. Grr. What is this? What are you doing? I mean, what are you doing? <laughs> Did you look? 
Maybe it's pl show me, please. Huh? <laughs> show you, stupid pervert sleazeball. I hate you. <laughs> Wait, why would I show you? This isn't meant for you to see. Marie is blushing furiously. I just forget this happened, all of it. I'm hypnotizing you. I'm hypnotizing you now. Sleep. Sleep. You didn't see anything now. Wake up. <laughs> <laughs> that is quite an interesting reaction. Is what is on that paper really that embarrassing? Welcome to the Velvet Room. Excuse us. Now, once again, welcome to the Velvet Room. Welcome, my butt. That was close. <laughs> Marie returns to her seat and fidgets relentless, restlessly. Marie <laughs> Margaret is such a bitch. <laughs> That's exactly what she is right now. <laughs> that was a bitch move, Margaret. That was such a bitch move. But anyway, since we have monies, since we have monies and we can screw the rules if we want to, um, we can pretty much... We got a jester. We're gonna keep that, because that's for a social link later that we need to get. Uh, we don't really need Lucifer, but I like having him for Victory Cry. Jadon, Ukobak. Pixie, Angel, Slime, Absaris, what, what the fuck? What kind of name is that? We need all of these to be honest, but we don't need a second. We don't really need a second chariot. Can we make a hero fin from any of this? Nope. Well, yeah, we can. We can use a temper. Speaking of temper, we need to hang out with the lady more often we need to hang out with Aerie we need to focus on Aerie we need to focus on the strength club we also need to focus on Yumi uh, am I willing to do that right now for Izanagi nah nah so what I'll do is just pay to get a hero fence type back so let's just pay to get one back. I thought I could easily make one, but eh. depends on how much it costs to bring one of these guys back. Oh, two thousand dollars ain't that much. All right, so we can use that. So whenever we hang out with Dojima, we don't have to struggle to raise his relationship up. Mm hmm. It's so dark out. It looks like it's midnight. It's, but it's just after school. Holy shit. It actually looks like that kind of outside my house right now. Well, we can't hang. We cannot hand in the damn quest right now. So the best thing we can do currently is just eat at Aya. Because we got to eat at Aya a number amount of times to get a book. Central Shopping District, Chinese Diner, Aya. You accepted the Ready Day Mega Beast Boat Challenge. Yep, yep, yep. Let's just scroll through this. You tried your best to finish the Rainy Day, blah, 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 and you finished it. Aya! I imagine you finished that entire thing. Since you ate all, you meal is free. <laughs> After finishing your meal, you went home. I can just picture that guy with a heavy Chinese stereotypical accent. It stopped raining, but the thunder was loud. Were you scared, big bro? Nah, I ain't that scared. We can either read a book or hang out with Nanako, and honestly, we should hang out with Nanako. Um... Nanako looks as if she's not doing anything. Uh, you feel your relationship with Nanako is in advance yet? Yeah, let's hang out with her. Yeah. Nanako looks happy. Alright, we gotta hang out with Nanako as much as we can. Alright, so the next time we hang out with Nanako, our relationship will increase. You can tell if it's going to increase or not. Because you will get a pretty much a notification. Oh my god, the ambulance is outside again. <laughs> Oh my goodness. But anyway, like I was saying, uh, you can tell if your relationship is ready to advance because it will say if you're if it's ready to advance or not in the notification you get. So we pretty much got to study. We don't need to, honestly. We can hang out with our friends today. Oh, hello. Uh, it's me, Chie. What's up, Chie? 
Would you mind hanging out with me for a while today? I need to go get my mind off studying for a bit. Um, yeah, why not? This should rank her up regardless. Oh, uh, yeah, sure. Uh, there's nothing else we could do here, so. Even if, if, even if I didn't accept a call, I think I could have still found her outside and we could have hung out anyway. But I think the phone calls boost the social link further, though. Hmm. Let's call it a day. Oh, it's Chie. What you doing? T Takishi? Well, training. I'm working out. When are you going to graduate to being king of the hill? <laughs> King of the Hill. In kindergarten, it was the runt gang. In elementary school, you were in Allied Justice. Middle school, it was the vanguards of the lunch revolution, wasn't it? So what is it now? You're a protective Earth's peace? <laughs> well, let's say quit bagging on her. Let's say none of your business, because I think we said quit bagging on her last time. Let's say none of your business, asshole. Huh? <laughs> she is surprised that you called him an asshole. This is an M-rated game, after all. <laughs> oh, uh, I didn't mean that. I didn't mean that in a mean way. I'm Takeshi Kono. I was I was with Chie up until middle school. I'm not gonna get in you guys' way. Damn right. Uh, wait. What What are you? Oh, how's Yukiko-san doing? Does she have a boyfriend yet? She's fine, and I don't think so. I see, cool, cool. She's still good looking? Maybe I should gonna try for her again. <laughs> I'll see you later. Say hi to Yukiko-san for me. That guy's an asshole. How'd you, why'd you even hang out with this guy in middle school? What'd you, what should you do? <laughs> Crack a joke, bad mouth to Kichi. Let's hold Chie's, let's hold waifu number one's hand. <laughs> what? A match you want to spar? <laughs> Don't scare me like that. I won't hold back, you know. Chie's face is red with headache. I'm sorry, he really is rude, huh? Seriously, he was always staring at you, Kiko. Hey, don't get me wrong, he's nothing but an old classmate to me. We're just friends, you know. We used to get that a lot, though. Chie some smiles somewhat sadly. You thought that you learned something about Chie's past. She had a crush on a boy that didn't even like her. It is very apparent here. Rank 4 with Chie Saranaka, aka waifu number 1. Let's go. I'm taking a sip of my sobe right now. Ah, so good. Chie's growth of heart was affected by her persona, or affected her persona as well. Ice boost. Rampage. But that's all in the past. Let's head, head home. home. I didn't even know she See was going to that. You talked with Chia about various things while walking home. Daytime, evening time. Mm. Hey, what's going on, Nanako? What's up? Nanako seems to be in a lost thought. Or still in a lost thought. <laughs> Nanako seems to be lost in thought. <laughs> Wait for her to speak up. Uh... Let's say Asker was wrong. Let's say that. Um, well... That face she makes is adorable. No, Nicole fidgets. I made flowers at school yesterday. They said today is Mother's Day. My teacher told us that's a day when you give your mom flowers. I don't have a mom, so... I don't know what to do with these flowers. Of course you have a mom. She's dead, but she's not alive. <laughs> Nanako seems upset. Oh, shit. You can give them to her. Let's say that. Huh? Any other choice would just be oh, kind of ridiculous. You mean the family altar? Dad always puts food there. He said it gets to mom in heaven. Do you think my flowers will get to her too? I'm sure it will, Nanako. I did a really good job on mine. My teacher said they were pretty too. I wonder if my mom will be happy to get them. 
Nanako seems happy. You should make a flower too, big bro. Then we can celebrate Mother's Day together. Sure, why not? Nanako taught you how to make an origami flower. We did it! Who taught you how to make these, Nanako? Huh? What was that? A guy named Scott? A guy named Scott taught you how to make these. Awesome. <laughs> okay. So what can we do? We could probably read a book. I think that's the best option here, to be honest. So let's read a book. Read a book. Let's read a book. Off today, office work manual. You know what? Let's work on the longest ones. Because once we get the speed reading book, we can pretty much start reading through books super fast. So let's work on the office work manual first. Take a look, it's in a book, reading rainbow, I can do anything, do 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 Your first midterm, oh no I forgot about the midterms, but you know what, I'll ace this, I didn't have to study at all, I didn't, I completely forgot to study, but it doesn't fucking matter, cause I'm the swag tagging this. Exams are finally starting today. Real life's harsh. Learn to pick your battles. <laughs> uh, way to put it all in perspective. <laughs> but even once exams are over, we're not done with the case. All this depressing stuff just gonna keep going on and on and on. Yeah. We ain't got no choice though. Do 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 do. Finally, the music is back. When it's on rainy days, it's kind of empty. Midterms day one. What is it called when muscles grow after exercise? Overexertion. Looking is overcompensation, actually. You feel like you've chosen the correct answer. What is the year before 1 AD called? Obviously, it's 1 BC. You feel like you've chosen the correct answer. You are a smart motherfucker, you know that? <laughs> it's May 10th. Yes, 2011. Midterms day two. Which one of these numbers do not exist? Marriage numbers! Holy shit, you also chosen the correct answer. Who translated I love you as the moon is beautiful, isn't it? Now, I am not exactly sure on this, but I think it was Soseki Nisumi. Uh, yeah. If, the, if I think that's right. Is it Shime Futa? Uh, it's one of these two. But, if I said Soseki first, then it's Soseki Nasumi. You feel like you've chosen the correct answer. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! I didn't even have to study for this shit. Oh yeah! <laughs> Midterms Day 3. Who said, as soon as laws are necessary for men, they are no longer fit for freedom. Alright, I am back. Oh, I'm sorry guys. I was looking at my sister in the background like, what the hell is she looking at? <laughs> but anyway, I'm pretty sure it's, uh, this guy. I don't know how to pronounce his name. Which one of the following is the highest mountain in the solar system? It is, I believe, in the solar system, is Olympus Moons. That's what I think I want to say. Alright, now since we have max knowledge when we took that test, and since we know, I know we got all the questions correct, we will be able to get some stuff we couldn't do, or I, I didn't get on my first run through. Now, Nanako actually gives you some accessories for maxing out on these quests. Or not quests, but tests. The answers seem to be flowing from your hand. It's like, man, this shit is too easy. You seen his head shake? He was like, man, this is too damn easy, man. I should be in college by now. It's finally over. Damn right, broske. Ooh, what a load off. I bet every student feels like this after exams are over. <laughs> hey, quiet down. So what did you write for number seven? 
The one about what that referred to in the sentence? <laughs> that? Um, I put her sorrowful expression. Oh, crap. Then I got it wrong. I put the rice cakes on top of the table. <laughs> what? Rice cakes? Wait, was that what the story <laughs> All right. I'm giving up on composition. I'm going to bet it all on geography. What did you choose for the tallest mountain in the solar system? Elephants Mons. Let's lie. Let's lie and say Mount Maxwell. Ah, seriously? I chose the wrong one. Oh, I put that one too. Whoa, you too? And it's probably the right answer. No. Haha, <laughs> lie. They think it's the right answer because I said it was. Boy, I can't wait for our grades to be posted out in the hall where everyone can see them. Jeez. I feel like a bad person because I lied to him. <laughs> hey, did you hear? A TV station's filming here in town. They're probably just doing more stuff about that hanging corpse case. Hey, it's Akihiko. No, it's not that. You know the highway nearby? They're going to cover those biker gangs that hang around there. Biker gangs? A friend of mine goes to the biker meeting sometimes. I heard it from him. Dude, what are you doing hanging out with a guy in a biker gang? <laughs> well, anyways... What do you think about tomorrow's group blind date? We were gonna meet outside, but... Group blind date? What the hell? It's gonna rain soon, right? Won't it be better to play it safe tomorrow, too? She has an Adidas bag, I think. Biker gang? That girl in the front, she has an Adidas bag. Oh, yeah. They raise a ruckus from time to time. I guess your place is too far away to hear them. We live right by the road. The noise can drive you insane. I hear some guys at this school are part of it, too. Yeah, I know there are some rumors about a first-year student here who's a total hellraiser. Yes. One of the guys working at Jeunesse said the dude's been a legend ever since middle school. Although, was he in a biker gang? Did... did you say he was a legend? A legend. Uh, it's not what you think, Yukiko. <laughs> legend. Uh, now, we'll be hearing much more about this legend as we progress through the game and we'll actually be able to meet this legend later but for now we got quests to do 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 we'll have to go ahead and pick up the angel statue the next time we're in the tv world but we won't do that until we have to go into the tv world and we also got to talk to this chick again here we go hey you listen Hey, listen! The confession words! Are you listening? Hey! Hey! I can't believe it! I'm so happy! Are you even listening? I'm glad I got this shoebox confused with yours! Oh, that's right! I need to give thanks at the Tashumi Shrine! My wish came true! I'll make a big offering! You accomplished the request written on the Emma! The monetary offerings have been increased! You should report back to the Fox! I wish for love! Complete it! All right, awesome. So we completed one quest, so we can hang out with Yumi, Broske, or Daisuke. Um, before we even do any of that, I think we got some stuff to do. We can do some quest. Now that exams are over, I feel like a weight has been lifted. These are the days that give us. Wait, what does that say? Give away. Give way to temptation. There we go. I can't even read that word. I don't know what to do. I'm trying to think right now. Like, all right. So let's look at our social links. We already took. Uh, so we completed that in request. Request. So we should hold on to that until a rainy day, until we can't hang out with anybody else. That's when we should hang that or uh, hand that quest in. Um, we hung out with Chie much enough already. We can hang out with Broske if we want to. What is today? Can we hang out with... We cannot hang out with Aerie, which I might do tomorrow. So we can start getting her rank... Or start ranking her up. So, uh, maybe I will hang out... Nah, let's hang out with Broske. Yeah, let's hang out with Broske. Yep. You feel your relationship with Yosuke is going to become closer so Yeah. All right. All right. Let's hang out with Broske. Nice. We're in the city. 
Okina City in front of Okina Station. Yosuke brought you all the way here. Mmm. It's been a while since I breathed this kind of air. You know, I'm just a poor little city boy drawn to the urban scent. <laughs> Wait a minute, am I starting to sound like Teddy? You're looking hairier, bro. <laughs> now that you mention it, the foam in my facial soap. Hey, <laughs> this moment. <laughs> The foam in my facial soap this morning had. What the hell? <laughs> You're making me scare myself. I kind of read that kind of differently in my head, so I had to read it out aloud differently. Oh, a text message. More spam. Looks like someone got my address. I get a lot of a lot of spam. Hey, yeah, what can you do? You don't block them. Why not change addresses? Let's say you don't block them. Hmm. Even when I do this, they change domains, so there's no point. And I don't want to change my address. Yosuke is sorry. I haven't changed addresses since before we moved to Inaba. I mean, I might get a text from someone. It's hard to call, you know. If I call, if I called people just to tell them my number change, they'd get annoyed. And some of them never plan to text me anyway. Oh, but hey, don't look at me like I don't have any friends. <laughs> to, tell you, to tell you the truth, I don't remember what we all used to talk about. Can't really call them friends. You know what suits me just fine. Plus, I got something I need to do there. <laughs> Counting on your partner. You can sense Yosuke's enthusiasm. You feel you understand Yosuke's a bit more. Rank up! <laughs> Alright. You can now perform a follow up attack during battle. With that in mind, should we head back? It'd suck if something happened back there while we were over here. Alright, let's head home. Wait, let's get everyone a souvenir then go home. But All right, let's go. The shops were over there, broske. Why are you running back up to the train station? That was awkward. You're back. Hey Dojima, what's up? I went shopping today, the fridge is full of food. Hey, can I have a word with you? You go to Juna's a lot. Very often. That ass Adachi keeps a and then, hold on, let me say his name right. That ass, Adachi, keeps vanishing every now and again. <laughs> I figure he's probably slacking off around Juna's whenever he does. If you see him hanging around when you're at Juna's, he's probably goofing around. So if you go, if you see Adachi at Juna's, tell him, tell him off for me, okay? You remember that you've seen Adachi in the food court before. The next time you go to Juna's, you should go, you should be on the lookout for Adachi. For Adachi. Going on and on and on. Mm -hmm. So let's go ahead and save the game. And since we did that, we could probably do something else before we end off on this video. Um. Oh uh, shoot, Dojima or Cook? I really want to get the trophy. I think we have enough time to actually max out Dojima. We should be able to max out Dojima here if we skip a night with him. So let's go ahead and cook a lunch for tomorrow. Do it. Surprisingly, you have the ingredients to make meat stew. You decided to make meat stew. So if I do get this wrong, I can just reload it here. You only have to simmer it. How should you simmer it? Simmer it. Simmer without a lid. With the with the drop lid. Use strong heat. Simmer it with a drop lid. Let's do that. The ingredients have been deliciously cooked to completion. It came out perfectly. It looks really amazing. Obtain long simmered meat stew. You want my long meat stew? <laughs> you want a taste of this long meat stew? <laughs> dun, 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 dun. You brought lunch today. Do you wish to eat with someone? Of course I do. So who the hell should we eat with? 
We already ate with Yumi. We don't want to pick favorites. Hmm. We already we don't need to hang out with Chie. Let's go with Daisuke in the game. Let's let's see if uh, we can eat with Daisuke. Let's see what happens if we choose him. Oh, nice Daisuke and Ko are up here. You ate lunch with Daisuke and Ko. You ate long simmered meat stew together. This is good. I didn't know you could cook. You got enough for seconds. My stomach's a po bottomless pit. Daisuke enjoyed your lunch. You feel that your relationship is going to become closer. Nice. Alright. So I think since we actually. You'd be called taking your part time job at the daycare center. Damn it. We can't do that. We can probably do that tomorrow though. But anyway, what we probably want to go ahead and do is go ahead and start up a new social link I believe I think we might be able to start it up I think we could I just because Dojima said we can hang out with a dachi now all right I, not really hang out but keep an eye out on a dachi there we go oh hey a dachi what's the matter can I help you <laughs> what are you doing this sucks what's it look like I'm working it's easy to investigate here with all the people around. It's cool in the summer and warm in the winter. It's a pretty good place to... Oops! Yeah, I think I said enough. It seems that Dachi is slacking off. <laughs> that's all I came to ask. I'll hang out with you too. Huh? That's a little strange. <laughs> Alright. What are you doing here? Killing time? It's tough to do out here in the sticks, isn't it? There's nothing here. It's not like the city at all. <laughs> you can say that again. You're right. I knew you understand. You're from the city too, right? <sighs> Get this, my first assignment here was tracking down a cat. My suit got so dirty and they wouldn't let me expense the dry cleaning bill. Next I played peacemaking in a spat some married couple was having. I can't believe they got the police doing that stuff. A dodgy seems unsatisfied with country life. But it's been more dangerous lately, so I can't kick back. There's that one case, you know. It's still not solved yet. The higher-ups don't know what to do. They keep changing procedure on the fly. Sorry! I hope I'm not making you nervous. What the hell? Us police are on the job. You sense that Adachi cares for you. You feel you understand Adachi a bit more. Oh yeah, new social link has been acquired. Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou has established a new bond. It brings thee closer to the truth. Thou shalt be blessed when creating personas of the Jester Arcana. Believe it. <laughs> you have established Toru Adachi Social Link of the Jester Arcana. Well, you know. Well, you know. <laughs> That's kind of funny. <laughs> oh, that was close. Adachi doesn't seem to want to see that old woman. Huh, I wonder why. I better go. You hurry on home, too. Oh, don't tell Dojima I was in Junus, okay? <laughs> Whatever you say. You watched Adachi go back to work, then went home. All right. Young men recklessly riding their motorcycles, disturbing the peace of a quiet rural town. Rural town. Our special report took a turn for the violent when one of the apparent leaders attacked the camera crew. <laughs> the hell are you punks doing here? Young delinquent. That voice. The Santa show. Get bent. <laughs> Get bent. Troy Still Baker. The same old tricks. Troy Baker in the house. Do you know him, Dad? Uh, well, I know him through work. <laughs> His name's Kanji Tatsumi. He's quite a handful. He's been crushing biker gangs in the area since middle school. Since middle school? Holy shit. I thought shit. he got into a high school and started attending class. Huh. 
Man, that blur sure is pointless. It's completely <laughs> obvious who it is. <laughs> the blur sure is pointless. Uh, the guy's family runs a historic textile shop. I think what happened was he crushed the local bikers all by himself because the noise kept his mother up at night. Uh, it's a nice gesture, but he's way too violent. At this rate, his mother will have to apologize again. Oh, the weather report's showing on the bottom. It's going to rain tomorrow. I'll make sure to hang the laundry inside the house. Sounds like the perfect time to hand in the Foxy Fox request. Alright. Whoa! It started raining. I guess the weather report was right. That means the show's probably going to be on tonight. Yep. I hope we don't see anyone. Yeah, that'd be best. But if we do, maybe we'll see some kind of clue that can point us toward the killer. Well, everyone, don't forget to check your TV tonight. Will not forget. Got it? Got it. It seems to be another rainy night. What will you see on the Midnight Channel? We can only hope but wonder. <laughs> 